more protein in beans than meat anyway. Stole my line. <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen something like this before? Yeah, yeah. Yeah? Different. My brother's a vegan, you know what I mean? So I oh, cool. see it a lot, you know what I mean? Did you know about the bi-kill thing? The what? The, so it's talking about how it's talking about how unintended species like sea turtles, whales, dolphins, sharks, and all those are um, caught at uh, about a five to one ratio as target catch when we eat fish. Oh, you mean um, when we catch fish, we get um, a bit of dolphin in there as well? Is that you mean? That's exactly. Oh, yeah, it. I know all that's that. And they throw a little bit of back, and then we popped up. Yeah. Have you considered veganism yeah, yourself? All the time. I, I do. I do. I, mean, I understand. Yeah. We want to. How do you feel about this? About the yeah, um, about the, the um, male chicks in the egg industry? Yeah, I think I that's the one that. that well. I know we're pretty much with that. <laughs> I don't know how they throw them all away and they just kill them all. But, you know, I know all about the calves, the baby cows. Sometimes I eat food and I'm like, oh, all these like images and they're popping in yeah. and I'm like, wow, I'm actually seeing what I'm eating now. Like, oh, it's dark shit. <laughs> I think that's a great way to put it. Seeing seeing what you're eating and yeah, and, yeah, yeah. and once that becomes who you're eating, it, should, it completely changes things. And it sounds it sounds like from what you're saying, you really want to do it. It's just a matter of kind of figuring out a way how. Yeah, exactly. It's like, a, it's like yeah. being a drug addict, isn't it? And I think it's like try, taking the first step to you know, not eating meat. You raise an interesting point about kind of the convenience side of it, because what do you think is greater, the inconvenience to us, like on a day-to-day -day basis yeah, for yeah. those small, uh, those it's, it's changes, price. or or the inconvenience that um, putting it mildly on the animals? You know, if yeah, you weigh yeah. those two things up, that helps me. It does help, yeah. It, it helps motivate me, you know, if I have to, you know, read ingredient labels, like actually, yeah. that's a pretty small inconvenience compared to if there's an animal, yeah, yeah, you know, exactly, needlessly yeah. killed for it, so. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Say there's a really cool support program. I think you'd be interested it? in. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's it's free. It's basically a Facebook group. Yeah. Um, yeah. Com, right? You can get there to, to there from there. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it's 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 basically uh, uh, 22 days and beyond to explore veganism, and they give you daily recipe ideas I'm and information. Sick, that's what's the problem, man. Like, yeah, I don't fucking like to cook vegan food. In date down, I'm a hippie as fuck. I'm hippie. I'm punk. Yeah. So I'm hippie. But, you know what I mean, I, wanna, I, wanna, I do want to try Have you got any, uh, yeah. anything for that? That's okay. why I stopped anyway, I saw it out, I was like, yeah. That's I'm cool. <laughs> That's really cool. It sounds like you're doing great things, honestly, and I think it's just, just a matter of, you know, following your heart. I, I can tell just from a short time <laughs> talking to you, you have a good heart, mate. Like, <laughs> yeah. honestly. I want to make a film about it, and I don't get dairy anymore. I, I do my um, body weight exercises, climb up walls a lot, run about. Awesome. And I need protein, and I know that, you know, if it's a way I could have protein that's not fucking meat, then I'm, I'm up for that defo. And actually, it's better for you. There's more protein in beans than meat anyway. Stole my line. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, so what, what's, what's, what's the best thing, what's the best plan for me then to start put, put the first step? Yeah, forward? I don't know if you have your phone with you. I or, or I, no, no, I'm I, not right here. Yeah, <laughs> so it's up to you. There's, there's two options. I highly recommend this first one that's based on Facebook. And you're basically chucked into a group, and you can, you can uh, support each other. And I find they're just charged with positivity, and you get loads of information. Yeah. yeah. And the cool thing is, you get uh, mentors, and you get free access oh to registered like, dietitians. Just like AA, in it. Well. Yeah, I think for me the whole thing, because um, like you, I've kind of been, I thought about it for a long time before I went oh, right. vegan. Oh, I right. see so you were. Uh, and, yeah, yeah. and having the support network really changed. Oh, really? Made, made the difference. Yeah, same. So I can absolutely, I can tell you're a strong person and you can absolutely oh, right, do yeah. it. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. That's cool. Uh, and I always, I always have a feeling that if I become a vegan, then I'll get a better life. Because not just for myself, but it's like, I don't know why, but it's a little, I'm, I don't know, I'm hip, but like, what you put in, you kind of get back to it. So, I don't, whatever you eat, you actually, it's from an, uh, a suffering animal, and the more you put out suffering, you, but the more you kind of give, but today, you know what I was doing? I was running up and down the fucking beach, <laughs> and I was raising all the bees, and I was getting all these chips and the, all the fish, and of course, all everyone just goes, and then all these, uh -huh. all these seagulls just like, Bleh! and I was like, I was getting all this, and I was just like, just fucking go there, and all the people, who's a nutter going through the bins, and I was just going through the bins, getting all the chips and the fish. It's fucking shit though, it's just, rah, and all these seagulls just eat. So uh, I love animals, I'm a big animal lover. But I'll keep eating them, so uh, <laughs> I'm a bit yeah. of a so, anyway. I think a lot of us are inconsistent that way. I know I was for the first 32 years of my life. Yeah. I mean, I think for, for me, and I think you, it'll be interesting to see if you find the same. Uh, there's always part of my mind that yeah. didn't feel comfortable when I was eating these things, these, yeah, yeah. um, these animals. And when, once I uh, removed yeah, yeah. myself from that, that soft I mean, system, it, it, it liberated voice. me. Yeah. 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 Bad boys. Yeah, but, um, I think that's the cool thing about this is um, after a few weeks, yeah. routines, uh, yeah, routines become habits. Yeah. So it's that's the whole idea. So I'll, I'll give you that. What was your name? Pete. Pete. 
Pete Bennett. <laughs> Pete, I'm Jeremy. It's lovely to meet you. It sounds like you're interested in trying out Challenge 22, and I was just wondering, like, it sounds like you've been thinking about veganism for a while, and... Yeah, what I just you... love the number 22, you know? It's a number. How to do it? <laughs> but, I, I, I mean, I've thought about it for a long time, but, you know, like, you're kind of led. Uh, I, I'm the same with food, you know? I'm, oh, man, I'm a, I'm a food whore, you know, and... Uh, <laughs> I, big time. I love, I love food. Uh, but recently, I've been raining in a bit, so I am. You know, like, you know, stuff, but, um, <laughs> but my brother's a vegan, and uh, yeah, you know, and uh, it's just like he, he's like, go vegan, go vegan. And I got sick lately, I got the neurovirus, and I was like, oh man, I'm so sick. He's like, go vegan. And I was like, what do you mean go vegan? I'm like, you never get sick. I'm like, maybe he's got a point, you know, maybe. The only reason people are getting like bugs is because the food that we're eating is meat, and obviously we're not meant for that. You know, look at my teeth. <laughs> <laughs> it's flat. I ain't got fangs. I ain't got fangs. <laughs> um, I, I, I am. I am just interested. Obviously, every time I eat meat, I, I have dark thoughts about like the, 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 the little baby sheep and the baby cows. They're in my head. Oh shit! But you know, obviously, um, I know all about the cows. I love cows. I love cows. I love. I love new cows. I thought I don't drink their milk, obviously. But I know about the calves, and so I'm putting that. I put that first step forward, anyway. I don't drink dairy anymore, and uh, yeah, and, uh, uh, um, yeah, <laughs> it's cow pus. <laughs> it's rough, man. It's dirty stuff, man. Um. I, I like the idea of, um, it sounds like with Cow Kong, you're going to have a cow, you know, come back and, and, and try to rescue their young that has been taken away yeah, from them. Yeah, that, that sounds like a quite cool concept. Yeah, well, you know, I'm, into, I'm an actor. I love B-movie horrors, and I thought this was a great way of having a massive cow like smashing through because obviously she's been pumped full of hormones so she's about so she becomes 100 foot tall because these stoner farmers they leave the pump in her bum so you know, she becomes huge and, and so she's got this opportunity to smash out of the barn and go and go and find her calf who's going to be killed you know um, so this is this is the idea I had about this cow Kong so she could like smash through the city looking for her cow who's about to be killed and like you can see like there's McDonald's or others smash through McDonald's and all the army are, all the army <laughs> coming like trying to kill her like Rrr. well then she just takes a massive cow pack all over the army and like you know <laughs> and, and there's ways of killing people and she can like spray spray all these fucking people eating burgers with like milk just just drown them and stuff like that and uh, I mean I might even have laser beams coming out of her eyes uh, <laughs> but it's, it's, a, it's a film it's not just a film about a massive cow going up here it's got a message I mean even though I'm not a vegan yet I still actually share vegan things on Facebook and I get in trouble people are like you can't share vegan stuff on Facebook but the fact is this I can it's like because it affects me it actually makes me think oh my god it really makes me think about things so I share it and but and I get these people like militant like vegans so you can't share that because you're not a vegan I'm like well, I'm still fucking spreading the message what do you want me to do not share it it's still going to get it's going to still affect someone and give someone a little bit of food for thought uh, as long as it's not me <laughs> uh, yeah I need to find a way to to eat I'm not quite honestly, I'm not educated. I think that um, I think it's. I always think vegan foods are more expensive. Uh, is it? Is it not? Is it? I think it depends how you do it. I think if you buy the processed foods, like in, in, in boxes and, yeah. and wrapped up versus um, whole foods, I think it can be expensive. Yeah. I think on par with um, uh, eating non-vegan, um, I think you do save money when you focus on your know, rice, beans, bananas, cheapest foods on the planet. And I love all that yeah. stuff. Yeah. And it's obviously more pro more protein than the real meat. Win-win, and yeah. I'm, and I love, I love exercising and doing my uh, climbing and that. And you'll see, I'm always looking for a good protein source. Uh, yeah, you know what? When I was doing the, um, when I was at, I had a, gy a gym trainer and he was like, all you got to do is eat chicken. All you got to do is go home and eat chicken every day. I'm like, okay. Like, you can basically <laughs> buy these huge bags of chicken just so you yeah. can get like, really buff. And I was like, I ate so much chicken. <laughs> but it was just ridiculous how much chicken I was eating. And I could have just had like a little handful of beans and I would have still had the same amount of protein. Or instead of eating <laughs> about five lovely healthy chickens, <laughs> five dead chickens, or you know, you know, maybe a yeah. That side. I'm like, mate, they've got it all wrong. Yeah, we need to like see change. And the world's sick, man. This whole world. This, you know why it's hot like this? Because we keep killing all the animals. Isn't that true? Global warming. Yeah. yeah. Cow Cowspiracy is a great movie around that. Yeah. It sounds like you're nearly there, Pete. I think it's just a matter of kind of choosing to do it yourself. Yeah. And then I think I think as far as the situation with your mates, I think that's that can be challenging. I think the thing I would say, I would encourage you just to express your underlying feelings and say, you know, it makes me sad when I think about these animals not needing to be killed. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. It's, it kind of explain why you're doing it, and then I think they'll support you. <laughs> oh, I, I think that's it. I think vegans come in all different shapes and sizes. Yeah, yeah. They're and all, thin, they? I, honestly, Pete, I think you're gonna make an awesome vegan. Well, I'll give it a go. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Wouldn't you choose to? That's. I mean, it sounds like you're you're nearly there. Well, let's get the let's get the um <laughs> the uh, recipes first. Yeah. So, so, I have no idea about recipes.
I know you've got the B12 thing, so like, what's the marmite in that high? Is that right? Uh, Thirty-nine percent of Westerners um, don't get enough B12, so it's yeah. not just vegans. Yeah. So I think everyone should should consider supplementing. That'd be a great question to ask in that Challenge 22 group. I would, to, I would ask because because the registered <laughs> dietitians will really be keen to, to support you through that. I've yeah. I've met some massive guys really? that um, don't um, do any of the protein supplements and yeah. just get their um, vegans. Um, yep. No way. Food, um, actually, um, okay, I'm sold. Stephen <laughs> Cook, he's a born like born vegetarian and now vegan, so he's never eaten animals in yeah. his whole life. Okay. Well, thanks. For the, uh, thanks for the tip. <laughs> thanks, Pete. And honestly, I'll thanks for go. stopping. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. You, you can do it, mate. No, no, I can. I, no, I, I can. I do when, when I'm inspired by the people, basically, what I'm trying to say. Is that I do. Yeah. So thank you very much. I'll, I'll go home <laughs> and I'll eat a big bag of beans. And I, I have no doubt that you'll inspire others, too. <laughs> no, cheers, cheers, cheers a lot, Pete. Yeah. Actually, yeah. It's yeah. all about inspiration, isn't it? Like, yeah, uh, absolutely. I like inspiring people. It's good. Thanks yeah. for inspiring me. Yeah. Absolutely. <laughs> Should we hug it out? Yeah, come, come on, buddy. <laughs> cheers, Pete. Yeah, I'll probably see you running around. Here, so yeah, I'm up and down. I'm gonna feed some more seagulls. Oh, good on you, mate. Yeah. So much in the bins, just and they're all like begging. So just well, what's this? Just feeding them. Go. People just throw always food. They just feed the seagulls instead of eating the animals. Why you just feed it instead? Hey. Right. <laughs> <Great>. <laughs> <laughs> we'll leave it there. Cheers, Enjoy. Take care.